What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, and today we got a bunch of leaked content coming to Call of Duty Black Ops 4, but unfortunately, I'm not excited, nor do I feel like um, promoting these weapons locked behind a paywall, so please don't think this video is meant to be like that or anything. I just thought I'd let you guys know what's going to be coming to Black Ops 4. Probably within these next couple of weeks here, maybe even during the 4th of July week celebrating Independence Day. So, obviously I cannot showcase what weapons are going to be coming because I am going to be getting um, a copyright strike if I do that. However, I can show you some images from the previous Black Ops games as some of these weapons were a part of the older series. And they are the crossbow, which is like the exploding arrow crossbow from Black Ops 1. Um, the Argus shotgun, the M16 burst assault rifle. And yeah, these are the three ranged weapons coming to Black Ops 4. And then finally we have a melee weapon, which is a zombie arm. So pretty much just picture the mannequin arm melee weapon from Black Ops 3. Except it does have rings on each finger along with a golden watch. Um, so yeah, those are the four new weapons. And I say new in quotation mark because most of these weapons we've already seen before in the past Call of Duty Black Ops games. Except this time around we can only earn them through supply drops. So... Um, but yeah, that in itself isn't completely confirmed though, but I, I just can say that firmly. Don't expect them to be given out for free or anything in any other way. Just, they, they more than likely are going to be locked behind a paywall, which sucks a whole lot, but it is what it is. Again, please don't think I'm promoting this. I hope I'm wrong though, but again, we should see these weapons come out to reserves after Operation Spectre Rising is over, which is in 11 days, so on July the 2nd. And then that week, we could also see some Independence Day related loot items in a canoe contraband stream. Um, some of those items were also leaked out over on Twitter as well. We also got a look at the Ultra Weapon Bribe and a Duplicate Protected Bribe. Again, I truly hope there can be another way to get these bribes instead of just buying them only through COD points. I'd love it if maybe every like 10 tiers or 20 tiers at least, we can get an Ultra Weapon Bribe or a Duplicate Protected Bribe at least. So that way we can have something, you know, exciting, something we can look forward to instead of just the regular reserve cases. Um, but if you guys want to check out everything that was leaked out, all the loot items, um, I'm going to have a link down below to the images. And shout out to Joshua Cool for finding this over on Twitter. Uh, make sure you go check out his Twitter down below as well, guys. And yeah, this is some of the new loot items coming to Black Ops 4. And then we also got a pretty cool little audio cutscene, I guess you can say. Um, from the radios that can be found out throughout the blackout map and this has me pretty dang excited because it's adding some more backstory and lore um, behind the blackout map obviously I cannot play those audio files right now but I will link a video down below in the description that has this emergency broadcast and it contains some new quotes such as a unknown contagion which is spreading at an alarming rate the infected are breaching our defenses and the infected attack those around them honestly a lot of these quotes are extremely creepy and eerie definitely recommend watching the video guys now what I think this could be is in the next operation or map update for blackout we're gonna see some zombie related themes or maybe there could be like an infected LTM coming where if you die then you respawn as a zombie in blackout battle royale um, those are my theories guys but we're gonna have to wait and see when that update finally does come out and just see what's really going on here within Blackout Battle Royale. I'm excited, guys, for that. Uh, the weapons, though, and the weapon bribes, you count me out of that. But for Blackout Battle Royale, definitely, I'm looking forward to seeing what's going on here with that game mode. And so, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Please tell me your thoughts about this down below in the comments. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.